Hi everyone, I'm going to share with you how to make sunglasses and reading glasses case in one. So two in one that you can hold together. The interface and I'm using side here that 8 inches wide and the long side it's 16 inches long. So now you go on to fold this piece into four. As long as you divide these into four. I use the fabric marker. You can check in my description. Okay, so now there's four blocks. The first block here, you go going to leave it the way it is. The first block and the third you don't need to do anything so i'm gonna go to x the first and the, the third there the second one right here right in the side you're going to mark down two inches for me and draw on this line right now so i'm going to go ahead and cut this so i can use this side to trace in the last one So after I cut that out, I'm this piece right here, so that can be even, the piece that you just cut, go ahead and trace the line. You have something like this. You have the long the rectangle right here, the rectangle right here, and then the curve here, and then the curve at the end. So you go into place in the fabric, and you're going to cut two of this. So two. And I'm going to place this right on the fabric. The sticky of the interface and face in the wrong side of the fabric. So you iron on the, the fabric easier than you iron on the interface and pin like that just little and then you can flip on the other side now you're going to start iron on this side everyone after you iron the interface in the fabric right here you're going to bring the second fabric over and you place the wrong the right side of the fabric to the right side of the main fabric both of them are or main fabric anyway but I'm using the solid and the print you go on to sew all around I'm gonna start it from so this one right here or anywhere but not right in the middle okay don't do right in the middle of the fold you can do anywhere you can leave one area right here I would do I would leave about two inch and half and I'm going to start sewing from here all the way all the way to here go all around go down going up go all the way to over here and come in here and stop this area right here don't so so very close to here that's why I put the tip right in front of here um, some of you want to know like why I do the tape there this is from Andrea that's sharing with me this idea so she um, that I think is really helpful to share with other
go ahead and inside out this whole thing. After this, everyone, you're gonna go around and you press all the side down. And then the opening spade right here, go ahead and push it back, pull, and then stuck it back in. So everyone, after you iron, I'd like you to, from the top left here, you go on to top stitch to here and stop. And then from here, from here, from the straight line, go down to here and stop. I have a piece of uh, fabric in here that is one inch and a half by 10 inches. And so you can make it the little handle for this. You're going to sew the top line all the way and then this line all the way. Everyone is all done with the strap here too. So I am going to show you how to fold the thing together and so we can sew. The folding is not hard. It's already half the, the line that we divide into four earlier. So this is one side and this is the other side. Very carefully. We're gonna unfold, okay? So you unfold one at a time. So we're going to do the curl on the right. We're going to fold it in. Every time you fold it in, you're going to iron it. That one side, on the left side here. The straight one and this one, you're going to fold this left down, go under. iron it now when you're done you go into this is like a book you're gonna fold in this way so now you have something like this this is one side for your reading class and the other side for your sunglasses on the top here you can see that we have the two separate one right here the strap that we make at the end right here, about half an inch right here, you go on to fold it in like this, okay? The fold, it facing the end is right here. On this side, do exactly the same, fold it. And this too, place it right here. how cute that is so now when you're done this is what you need to do you're going to sew in on the top here to sew all the way down to here go on the bottom sew it here a quarter of an inch go all the way up to the top and we're done like the triangle my needle down first to hold it right there and then I'm gonna lift this up here I fold the fabric, have nothing to do with this, but I'm going to place right in front of the, so it's the same level.
and the needle still there, so it's easy for me to turn around. Put it down, follow the tape, I'm gonna go to the other side. The needle still there, lift this up, turn around, right on the line, put this down, go all the way on the top. Go slow, you don't need to run the marathon, so go slow down. Right, I'm gonna take this out, in the same time I'm gonna hold on to it. Like this, I'm gonna turn like this, and I'm going to go down like a triangle. Hi everyone, I finished. And it looks so so handy. The one side for the glasses, and then the other one for one for the sunglasses, and then the other one for the reading glasses. So awesome. If you want a bigger, go out as high, everyone. So I make it uh, 16 inches. If you want a bigger, you can make it to 18 and then divide into four. Divide into four, it's super easy. You fold it into half and then the other half to half. So put it on here. Wrap my sunglasses. Go on the one side. How handy that is. And then the other side, you can put the reading glasses on this side for the reading glass. Thank you so much for watching everyone. This is for Renee and uh, I hope you like it. So cute. One side sunglasses, the other side reading glasses. Stay safe and take care everyone.